Well, hey folks, PC7 here, welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to the Maple Farm for Farm Sim 22. Okay, we've got a fair bit of hay. Definitely silage could be improved. I mean, straw. Um, <laughs> oh, I'm doing well. Uh, yeah. We could use about six more stacks of silage. We do actually have a fair bit of hay. Oh, man. Yeah, big mistake. This is the, uh, this is the reason the expression just because you can do a thing doesn't mean you should do a thing exists. Yeah. This is the height at max. In fact, five is pretty much perfect. So that's, uh, oh well. It's there now. <laughs> um. So a couple of things today. We are, I was looking at the bales because we are pretty much ready to uh, do another grass uh, run. I think that, really? You liked it so much the first time you replanted it in sugar beets. Well, good for you. But first of all, I noticed that our food of the pig is not mixing because we're shy of product and I do believe I suppose I could have stopped and checked we'll go do that right now pretty sure we have some yes we do not a lot that would be corn by the way so yeah we don't have a lot but we have some and that's, uh, that's what we require, is some. Seems a, a common thing, doesn't it? Hope everybody's doing well today. It is April 1st. Indeed. And if I were the type, this entire episode would be a practical joke. But I have no sense of humor. Okay, let's, uh, let's carry on. In fact, I've, I was once told that Canadians just don't have a sense of humor. Boy, oh boy, the list of Canadian comedians I sent that fella was uh, <laughs> pretty mind-blowing. Okay, at any rate, hope you're all doing well. It is uh, another blustery spring day here on the Sunshine Coast of beautiful British Columbia. Indeed. A little bit chilly. I, uh... Well, you really thought about that, didn't you? Crap. Um. <laughs> yeah, any trailer will do. It's just a box on wheels. Yeah. So, shall we just start the episode again? Well, hey folks, just taking the corn out for a walk. <laughs> oh, such a nice sunny day. I thought it would appreciate some fresh air. <laughs> Get back in the box. Okay. That's, uh... uh Repark this trailer. And then we'll get the one that actually allows us to unload items into the pig feeder, since that's kind of what we're doing. I mean, it was close. If I'd have gone but one garage over, we'd currently be finished this job. And uh, moving on to the next one, which of course is getting our mowage into place to start a grass run. But hey, nothing like looking after the old pig food first. There we go, look at that. This is probably going to suck up most of our corn. Because I think this thing holds a little more than that one. I might be wrong. Okay, I haven't used it since it's been quote-unquote patched. So we'll see how it goes. I suppose one should open the uh, cover when doing this. Corn, yes, please, start. Nice. Yeah, that did use up a fair chunky of it. 
We still got a couple thousand liters, so we can top it up. Alright, let's get that. Uh, pipe all the way out. Gotcha. Okay. Sounds like a swarm of bees, man. Okay, you're not emptying, that concerns me. Oh, well, I imagine if I were actually within 20 feet of the thing, that might be a different story. There we are. <laughs> there we are. Now, are you going to take it all? Or do you want, like, just the tip? No, looking good. How are the numbers looking? Okay, well there's not a whole lot of anything in there, is there? Besides pig food, which is... I'm just gonna say, nice. In fact, we may just remove some of this once we've tipped off our corn. And, uh, see about loading her into the pig fodder fooder. Pig fooder fodder. There we go. So... A bit of fancy maneuvering. I know it's hard to believe, but we're going to use the same trailer twice. Wee! Yeah. Okay. We're uh, going to try again. Have uh, no fear. Whoa. Okay, well, maybe, you know, a little fear is healthy after all. Okay. Alright, well, that's certainly in the spot. Okay, I'm going to hazard a guess that this trailer will not hold pig fodder. What do you think? Yeah? Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna go with that. Otherwise, we're going to end up banging our forehead on the keyboard, and that's never a pleasant experience. Oh, let's uh, pop the cover back on. <coughs> and now, ooh, deja vu. Boom. And you get Yeah, that's what it is. The auger wagon does not do this particular thing. Which is too bad, because it carries almost twice as much. Um Ah, we'll just go around the chickens. Watch the edge. That's a pretty insane little cliff there, I tell you what. Now, I think all the animals are pretty much fooded up, aren't they? Let's have a look. Let's have a look. It's just a cow machine. Okay, um, yeah. Could probably use a little more food in the old coop of chickens. The cows? Oh, well, yeah. We, uh, top them up here. A little while ago, they're only like a liter down. Alright, so, oh, I didn't even uh, look at our pigs. Hello, pigs. There you go, that looks a little better. And, of course, our sheep should be doing pretty good. Alright. <clears throat> Alrighty then.
let's uh, grab some mowage and head down the road. And I think we'll be taking Johnny B. Deer. Link, there we are. Okay. And we'll go around to this side so that we don't end up getting back in the same tractor. And because it's just more interesting, let's, uh... Okay, uh, here we go. <laughs> yeah, we'll, uh... Actually, let's go back there for a second. Three. Okay, this isn't uh, not the one I was thinking. Okay, tight fit, but it's a fit. Let's go. Let's go. Well, we didn't go far. No idea. It's a hedge in the way. <laughs> So, shout out to Sooty Farmer. I was watching uh, watching his episode there yesterday. Oh, the one with your uh, your daughter on there. That was really cool, man. What a great episode. And, uh, sounds like she really enjoys the game, too. So nice to see. It's not just us stodgy old dudes that like it. Okay, um... No. We need to go to the next farm. Oh, and good job with uh, marking where your gates were and stuff. Looked uh, looked good. And good idea. Good idea. Because no, you couldn't see those uh, gates when they were open. That uh, hedge swallowed them up quite efficiently. So. And there's a, there's a link to City Farmer's channel in the description down below. I do uh, urge you all to go and support his channel. It's awesome. <coughs> Okay, now, I assume since one is ready, they're pretty much all ready. Yeah. Now, I don't know if we sprayed this one. I know we sprayed the big ones. So, we'll just have to see, uh, well, you know, how it goes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, let's, uh, quickly squeeze through there. Okay. I think we fit anyway, but I can't uh, do anything about this. It doesn't show up in construction, and it's not something you can chainsaw down because, well, it's a concrete post. <laughs> so, yeah. So it's kind of a, well, it served a great purpose when there was 7,000 other buildings here. Unfortunately, at the moment, it serves little to none. So, yeah. But this is, uh, this is the farm we gotta, uh, make money to fill up with various, you know, squeaks and bars and buck buck bucks and stuff. Yeah, that's, uh, that's what they do. Um...
Yeah, we're gonna start right here. So, come on, come on. There you go. <clears throat> Just like you meant to. Let's get you unfolded. Let's get you lowered down. Let's get you lit up, man. Oh, I need to ensure. Uh, I need to move to the other moor. We have swath dropping. Excellent, excellent, excellent. That's what I wanted to hear. Okay, we're in full Moathon now. That actually fits in there quite nice, eh? <laughs> right on. Let's, uh... Sorry. Uh, Alt C. Control S. Auto with me. Excellent. We'll enable that. Show lines, sure. Uh, set A. Okay. B. Thank you. lift the rears. I'm not that concerned about the front because we're going to sort of sort of not worry if it makes a bit of a mess because it's all going to be within the boundary of the rest of the mess anyway so there we go let's take her back Whoa. all right <coughs> Get you across the top. Don't think we need one at the bottom. We'll see when we get there, I guess. And you're going to hit one of several trees, I'm sure. Yeah, you don't exactly work out square, do you? field beside us. So I think just because I am going to do a SOF down here. 
Okay. Let's drop you down. You down and let's go. <clears throat> All right, whoops. Uh, hoo -hoo. Hello. Okay, then. <laughs> yeah, we did that. Alright, now... so far off. Okay. Well, whatever. Let's put the rears down and get this done. So this little guy will do up his grass, because we're not going to use that much of it compared to uh, the rest. And then I guess we'll do... Uh, one field as silage and one field... Yeah, okay, I can't turn these like that. Kind of a pain in the butt, but it's the way it goes. There, now it's whoa, what? Oh, it didn't lower. I hit the V. I assure you, I hit the V. Okay. Did that time. Let's go. And as I say, I'm hoping we're going to do a little better because it's been fertilized and stuff this time around, too. So... Okay, this is going to be a bit of an abrupt stop, so let's start breaking. Nice. Whew. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Of course I've got to sneeze. <coughs> At least once. <clears throat> Don't know why. Every time I go to make a video. Geez, actually a good thing I looked down. I just noticed one of the uh, plugs running one of my outdoor cameras was half out of the uh, socket. So, I'll fix that up. Okay. And down you go. Down you go. Excellent. Excellent. It's 
suppose I could have just done a double headland and saved myself all this mucking around at the top and the bottom. Probably would have been a better idea because, uh, well, it's not like a, a tractor and baler are going to be doing much better trying to turn around in that space. So. I'm going to do that. We'll end up, uh, in a better position in the long run, I think. So I should have just done this from the beginning. We would have been almost finished the field, I think. Well, I'm still faffing around, but at least I don't have to worry about the mowers getting on to stuff I don't want it to get on to. There we go. Yeah, we'll be able to get it done much quicker now. So yeah, we still got those. <laughs> now do I have two grass fields over there or three? Let's mm -hmm. so have a look at our uh, the Mwapo. Okay, okay, we do have three there. We've got these four grass fields. Okay. Jeez. We got a lot of grass. We could probably part with this one, but I mean, it's, you know, I'd say this farm is going to become ours. Well, the farm is ours, but I mean, it's going to become a, a useful entity, I'm hoping, by next summer. So. Yeah, a little bit of a struggle, but I mean, there's not much question that this is a serious hill. <laughs> they have a little bit of slip off on tires, but they're pretty chunky monkeys. Take a fair bit to spin those up, I think. No, uh, no, let's get a little better lined up than that, shall we? That was just a poor job. There we go. Send her on down the line. Literally. Uh, 
and hard brakes. Go, go, go. Got to remember that little strip at the edge there. It's not going to amount to much, but hey, it is. So it's all ours. So I'm going to have it by guppies. Hmm. I wonder... Uh, what sort of uh, snow geo they gave this place. Like, are we going to end up with uh, lots, a little? And that hill is steep. It is steep indeed. And I think we're going to do this on a field by field basis. Like, I'm going to pick this field's grass up, and then I'm going to probably spray it with some fertilizer um, and then we'll move on to another field um, well this one it's gonna have to just accept the fact that was never designed to amount to much. <laughs> there we go. Clean it all up anyway. Whoa. Yeah, that's a bit of a... Send you flying out of your tractor seat kind of place, isn't it? Wow. this off. Alright, and up the hill we go. And I'm going to park him out of the way on the next field over. I think there's sort of a roadish thing running between those two. So, not really. A, okay, well we'll just park between them then. Oh, here it is. It's on this side. Okay. There we go. And, uh... Oh, this is still growing. Okay. And this one's ready to harvest. Well, I'm feeling by the time we harvest this, which is a reasonable... <laughs> oh my god, it's huge! Um, a reasonable size feel. That, uh... The next one will be ready. So, and etc. Because, yeah, all the way from way the heck down on that dark patch to, well, the horizon is our grass fields. But that's going to do it for this one, guys. As I said, I'm going to, uh, next time around, we'll bring the other tractor down and we will bail this into grassy goodness. And, uh, we'll give her a spray and then we can move on. All right. Hit that like button if you enjoyed the episode. Take care of each other. And ciao.
for now.